What's up, you guys? What's up, you guys? Um, sorry, I know my pocket. Uh, I was just doing the dishes, okay? Uh, cleaning up and stuff. So it's very to me to clean up my house today. Uh, and, and you know what? I've been. I'm not. I'm not laughing. It's like a nervous type of, you know. Holy Spirit's been pushing me to get this since the other day. Since some other words that I made, you know, for you guys, uh, that I made. Those other words that I gave for you guys. Ooh, the devil's lying. Uh, so, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna read it, okay? No sugarcoating, okay? Let the Holy Spirit do what the Holy Spirit's gonna do. Uh, first and foremost, let me just read this first, okay? Twenty-two, Luke twenty-two. Okay, I'm just, I'm just gonna read it, uh, and when I stop, I'll go back over. Chapter twenty-two, Luke twenty-two. His oppressors conspiring to kill him. Hold on, sorry guys. Luke, chapter twenty-two. His oppressors inspiring to kill him and a false disciple plotting to betray him. Now the feast of unleavened bread, which is called the Passover, was drawing near. And the chief priests and the scribes were seeking a way to do away with him, for they feared the people. Okay, And Satan entered into Judas, who was called Iscariot, and was of the number of the twelve. And he went away and conferred with the chief priests and officers as to how he might deliver him up to them. And they rejoiced and promised to give him money. And he consented and sought opportunity to deliver him up to them apart from the crowd. So whoever has been, okay, whoever's been watching and monitoring you, okay, for those of you, for whoever's been watching and monitoring you, okay, they have been paying other people to monitor you, okay? Your ex, your, uh, ex-friend, your family member, your brother, sister, cousin, however it fits. But whoever is watching you, and it's not just one person, okay? It's not just one person watching you, okay? So who, all, all of the people who are watching you, okay? Some of them are being paid by somebody else to watch you, okay? That's what, that's what, <laughs> thank you, okay? Uh, so Satan is using say, sorry text messages. Satan is using people close to you okay using people close to you to cause you warfare okay so while you have warfare from witchcraft right hitting you from all sides right but remember the video I made the other the, uh, that I the word I gave the other day that the uh, the Lord protects us right from the witchcraft, but we we feel the the residual, you know, the we feel we feel the magic lightly, okay, so that we are able to endure, right? And so the enemy is using all of these people, okay, now. Like, just like my situation, okay? Uh, one of these, one or maybe two of these people are uh, children of God also as well, right? Maybe two of these people are children of God as well, okay? And these are the ones who have been doing the witchcraft on you, okay? Just like me, I have the same thing, right? And uh, 
as well as a family member, right? I'm just gonna tell you, it's my mom. I know it's my mother, okay? She probably watches my videos or whatever, but it's my mother, okay? I love my mother, and I would never, I could never ask for another, okay? But remember, we wrestle not against flesh and blood, okay? So it's easier said than done when, when we say not to take something personal, okay? When people do stuff, to, does when people do things to you, you know, uh, people are like, don't take it personal. It's it's hard not to take it personal, but this is why we have to remember what the word of God says, right? That we wrestle not. That we wrestle not against flesh and blood, right? But against principalities, right? And the dark realms, right? Okay. <clears throat> so I'm gonna keep reading. I'm gonna. I finished that. I finished that. Okay. Oh, here comes the smoke. I think. Ooh. And the day of unleavened bread came, on which the Passover had to be sacrificed. And he sent Peter and John saying, go and prepare the Passover for us so that we may eat it. And they said to him, where do you want us to prepare it? And he told them, behold, as you are entering into the city, a man carrying a earthen jar of water will meet you. Follow him into the house which he enters. And you shall say to the master of the house, the teacher says to you, where is the guest room where I may eat the Passover with my disciples? And that one will show you a large upper room furnished. Prepare there. This is going to be like. When the Holy Ghost fell at. Um, um, oh, help me, Holy Spirit. Ah, in the upper room, you got you guys know what I'm talking about, right? Or when all of the disciples were up there in the upper room, right? They were making themselves ready, right, for the Holy Spirit to to for the fire to fall, right? Dang, where was it? Okay, but this is that type of. Uh, 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 moment, okay, in season, right? Because if you notice, the disciples were in that upper room, right, making themselves ready, right, and all getting into alignment, right, waiting for the Holy Spirit to come, right, and then they, when the Holy Spirit came uh, uh, at fire, they started speaking tongues. The Holy Spirit just whoosh, hit the room. Everybody started speaking tongues of a, of, a, of a different and foreign language, okay? All different types of foreign language. And people outside that spoke those languages understood them, okay? Their abilities were heightened, okay? They had new gifts. They had all of the gifts of the fruit of the Spirit, okay? Just like God is promoting us, okay? And doing the same thing for us, okay? The same thing for us. Pentecost. Thank you, Holy Spirit. When Holy Spirit uh, 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 fell at Pentecost, right? <laughs> Confirmation. I see Holy Spirit. Pentecost, okay? It's going to be a Pentecost type uh, 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 situation, okay? Type moment, okay? A Pentecost type moment, okay? The Holy Spirit, you're about to get a way, way more deeper in dwelling of the Holy Spirit, okay? I'm pretty sure you're already uh, experiencing different levels of your spiritual gifts. Uh, you're probably noticing different spiritual gifts, okay? Maybe your spiritual gift got tweaked a little bit, you know? You're noticing these changes. It's like every day of this, uh, of this transition, it's like every day of this transition, just a little bit more that we notice okay that makes sense it's at least me it's like a little bit more i notice every day okay going through this transition every day i notice a little something different okay but through it i'm crying and i'm shedding and i'm, I'm going through just hell just to be totally honest okay pure straight up h-e-double l okay going through it, okay? But the Lord is with me, okay? But the Lord was and is and will be always with me, okay? Because he said he will never leave me nor forsake me. He will never leave you nor forsake you, okay? Never leave you nor forsake you. 
So while the Lord's gonna be blessing us, right? <laughs> right? We know this, right? And 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 th this this famine, right, on, on the land is coming, right? 10, 10, 10, 10 on my timer. This famine is coming on the land, right? So remember, thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is reminding me of, of Joseph, okay, in Egypt, right? 10 23 on timer. Remember when Joseph's brother they 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 were jealous of him and they were uh, envious of him and they conspired right against him and, and basically faked his death and sold him right to, to, to Egypt right and long, long story short um you will you know before he went to Egypt he was in a pit right he was in this this hole this pit right this dark pit and that's where you were right that's where you were that's where we were okay in this dark pit, right, where nobody was there with us, right? Everybody was 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 pulled away from us, right? We were isolated by ourselves, right? 11, 11 on my timer, right? In the pit, right? I call the three Ps. The pit, purpose, palace. Pit, palace, purpose, <laughs> one of those, in whatever order it goes but the three p's okay you start off in the pit okay you start off being 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 stretched okay being being broken down right breaking off of the old off of you okay god putting you on the potter's wheel right and hitting you with that mallet and that chisel right just chipping off and chipping away at the old so that you can come into the new right right you can't put old wine in the wineskins, right? So change our thought process, right? Right? The mind of Christ, right? Confirmation of the Spirit up there. Come. Okay, sorry. So keep that in mind, okay? Now, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Come on now. Okay, there it is. So I got to read this and... I'm just gonna read it. Um, can avoid and trying to read it, but I'm just gonna read it, okay? <sighs> Luke 20 and 5 warning against the scribes, and all the people were listening. Wait a minute, let me see. Okay, warning against the scribes, okay? And all, and as all the people were listening, he said to his disciples, beware of the scribes who like to walk around in long robes and love greetings in the marketplaces and cheap seats in the synagogues and places of honor at the dinners who devour widows' houses and for a pretense make long prayers period, okay, these shall receive greater judgment, okay? The Lord is not playing, okay, with these false prophets, okay? The Lord is not playing with these uh, these people that are leading God's people astray, okay? That are, that are, that do not believe in uh, 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 in the Holy Trinity, right? The, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, right? They do not believe in that, right? They preach the prosperity gospel, right? And it's all think positive, you know. This think, uh, 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 you know, it's all, and, and it's and it's a lot of clap back too, right? If you've noticed that, if you notice this, God is revealing everything in this hour. The Holy Spirit is revealing everything in this hour. Okay, notice. And I don't care if you're saying this, like T.D. Jakes, okay? Notice uh, people like T.D. Jakes. Notice how they're coming undone and unraveled, right? Right? The prosperity gospel is falling, okay? Holy Spirit's bringing my memory back to when Jesus was overturning the tables, right? Because... They were the money changers were in there basically gambling. 
okay? Selling, buying and selling and making his, making God's house a house of merchandise. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Making God's house a house of merchandise, right? A house of things, right? Idols, okay? And what did Jesus say? Destroy this temple, right? And I will rebuild it in three days, right? And in three days, I will rebuild it, okay? Remember, days are as to, it's a God day, uh, one day is to a thousand years and thousand years to one day, right? Who's to say that three days wasn't three years, right? Or 3,000 years, right? Sorry, I'm excited. <laughs> or 3,000 years, right? Okay. Oh, goodness. Uh, that was a lie. That was a lie. Okay, so these are these are the people to watch for. Okay, if you're paying attention. Okay, because God is calling people out. Okay, He's saying, "Come out." Okay, come out of her, my people. Okay, her is the 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 churches of the world. Come out of her. Okay, come out of her. Come out of Egypt. Come out of Rome. Come out of and come out of her, my people. Judgment is about to fall. Judgment is about to fall. Like the great tribulation is, 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 I made one other video about this, okay? The great tribulation, either we're in it or it's about to pop off, okay? I have this, I don't know, I have, <laughs> I have a feeling in my spirit, like just, because the Holy Spirit's been nudging me for a couple days to, 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 to read this, to give this, and I've been procrastinating, to be totally 100% honest. I've been procrastinating because it says vengeance. <laughs> Y'all know what I mean, okay? It says vengeance, okay? You know, when it says vengeance, God is not playing. We know God's not playing anyway, right? But God's not playing. And especially about his people, okay? I'm about to read this. Stop from here. Okay. And some, I'm in mean, chapter 21, Luke 21. Okay. Praising the poor widow. And he looked in, and he looked up and saw the rich casting their gifts into the treasury. And he saw a certain impoverished widow casting there to Lepta. And he said, truly, I tell you that this poor widow has cast in more than all of them. For all these out of their surplus have cast in something into the gifts. I'm sorry. For all these out of their surplus have cast in something into the gifts. But she out of her lack has cast in all the living that she had. Those who... Those who who seek to save their lives will lose their lives, right? And those who seek to, who, who who give up their lives will have eternal life. I'm paraphrasing here, okay? But you guys know what I'm talking about, right? You guys, how do I say it? It was like you guys were the impoverished widow, okay? We were, okay, in this situation, the impoverished widow, right? Because these people came and used us, right? It's like we were a, because we, some of us are not what I came to spouses yet, okay? Uh, some of us are not, you know, like, we're not going to get there. Word for another day. But, like, we were the widow in the, in, you know, in this situation, okay? Because we were the ones giving to these people. We were the ones always extending our hands, okay? We were the ones always loving these people and comforting these people and doctoring these people back up to health. And then they turn around and bite us in the hand like a three-legged dog. Okay? And then they do it over and over and over, okay? Remember, we wrestle not against flesh and blood, okay? It is a spirit, okay? Jezebel spirit, okay? Python spirit, okay? 
a uh, cobra spirit, okay? I bind every uh, uh, a snake in demonic spirit right now in the name of Jesus. I bind every python spirit in the mighty name of Yeshua HaMashiach and I cast it back into the fires of hell in Yeshua's mighty name. Father God, I pray that the poison from any uh, demonic serpent that has been sent against the child of God, Father God, I pray that it is of no effect, Father God, in Jesus' name. Ooh, hallelujah. Father God, because you said that no poison thing shall harm us, Father God, that if we shall drink something poison, Father God, it will not kill us, Father God, because we have the Holy Spirit living on the inside of us, Father God, in Jesus' mighty name and Yeshua HaMashiach's mighty name. When I'm praying, when I'm going into warfare, uh, the enemy likes to try to steal my words, right? He likes to try to confuse me and steal my words, right? So you really got to fight through the warfare, okay? When you're when you're battling, okay? And as some were speaking about the temple, that it was adorned with beautiful stones and consecrated offerings, he said, as for these things which you are looking at, the days will come in which... There will not be left a stone upon a stone, which will not be thrown down. Okay? Seven. And they questioned him, saying, Teacher, when therefore will these things be? And what will be the sign when these things are about to take place? Those who have ears, listen. And he said, See that you are not led astray, for many will come in my name, saying, I am the Christ and the time has drawn near do not go after them you guys there's an uptick in cult leaders okay cult followings okay spiritual uh, 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 followings okay uh, you know new age it, it's all within new age okay you guys know or oh, those are the 222 oh my god 2222 oh the keys of david hallelujah you guys know that um those of you that do know uh that have been with me since my last page since i've lost touch my last page can't get in it but that i used to do i used to be i used to mess with divinant with tarot cards right see I, it's hard for me to even say it right because i am so far gone from that when it used to, uh, uh. but we were all in a you know in a place that we shouldn't have been, right? But the point being, ooh, see, he likes to try to come and steal my thoughts. Okay, the point being, thank you, Holy Spirit. Do not go after them, okay? The Lord says his sheep hears his voice. Okay, my sheep hear my voice and they know my voice and another's they will not follow. Okay, and another's they will not follow. Okay, uh, be aware too, you guys, there is a thank you, Holy Spirit. There is a false Holy Spirit, okay, out here, 2333 on the timer. And thank you, Holy Spirit. It's called a Kudalini spirit, which I bind in the mighty name of Yeshua HaMashiach and cast right back into the pits of, into the, pits of the lake of fire, okay? It's called the Kudalini spirit, okay? This is this false, the false Holy Spirit, okay? Remember, Satan mimics everything that uh, uh, perverts, copies and perverts everything that God does, right? Everything that God has created and made good, right? Instead, it's good, right? Satan comes and tries to copy that and pervert it, right? Even down up until the end, right? You... you if you if you really look at it, you can just laugh at the, at the devil, right? At, at Satan, right? Because he copies our father, right? In heaven, he copies our father, right? Perverts his good things, right? To 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 be like him, right? He copies him, right? But perverts it. But God is always ahead of him, right? But just listen to this. He copies him, right? So just listen. He's always following God, right? He's following God all the way to his demise, right? It's like God's just dog walking him, right? All the way to his demise, right? 
this is what's going, this is what's happening, okay? The enemy is defeated, okay? It is already done. The Holy Spirit said it's already done, okay? Things are about to happen suddenly, okay? I know you guys are tired, okay? I know you guys have been waiting, okay? I know hope deferred make the heart sick, okay? But you guys got to encourage yourself. Encourage yourself like David did, okay? Encourage yourself like David encouraged himself, okay? I know, I know it ain't easy. I know it's easier said than done, okay? I was just in a room, uh, boohooing and crying, like maybe what? 20, 30 minutes before I even got up on here? Maybe, yeah, probably about that much. 20, 30 minutes before I got on here, like, this thing is real, you guys. Like, this thing is real, okay? And I know I'm speaking to somebody, okay? I'm speaking to a lot of people. Okay, whether I know right now my, my channel isn't, it's not popping yet in the, in the algorithm, but the Lord is about to do a new thing. Okay, the Lord is about to do a new thing. He already told me about to do a new thing. Okay, it's going to be like a suddenly just bloop, just a suddenly just overflow, overflow, overflow. Okay, but for the world, for the world, okay, it's going to be the opposite. It's going to be the opposite for the world. The place between his ascension and the great tribulation. Chapter 21, Luke 21. Uh, Luke 21, 7 through 11. Okay. And they questioned him. Oh, I already read that. I read that. Sorry. Uh, do not go after them. And when you hear of wars and revolutions. Do not be terrified. Right. For these things must take place first but the end does not come immediately okay then he said to them nation will rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom right now okay more than ever and there will be great earthquakes and in various places okay so right here it says and there will be great earthquakes right but it's, there's a comma right there right that has me thinking Real quick, right quick. And there will be great earthquakes. And Maybe I should have kept reading it, huh? Yeah, okay. Let's keep reading it. Because now that I kept reading it, it makes sense now. Okay, duh. And there will be great earthquakes, comma. And in various places, famines and pestilences, okay? And there, didn't I just say about famine just a minute ago? And famines and pestilences, okay? And there will be terrors and great signs from heaven. The persecution of his disciples in the church age. 12 to 19. But before all these things, they will lay their hands on you and persecute you. Delivering you up to the synagogues and prisons. Bringing you before kings and governors for the sake of my name. Remember I told you guys that you were going to be brought in the pre uh, brought before the presence of what the world calls great men, right? And you're also going to be brought in the presence into the thank you Holy Spirit into the presence of actual great men. You are. You are. Remember there's always good along with the bad, right? Balance. You are going to be brought into the presence of great men, but you know Satan has counterfeits, okay? So uh, where was I? Uh, before all these things, lay their hands on you to persecute you, delivering you up to the synagogues and prisons, bringing you before kings and governors for the sake of my name. It will turn out to you for a testimony, okay? Like, this is going to be a part of your testimony. Big part. Settle it, therefore, in your hearts, right? Not to take thought beforehand how to reply in defense, okay? Be settled in your heart, you guys, okay? Uh, listen to the leading of the Holy Spirit and do not worry about what you're going to say, okay? You don't, even, don't have to prepare in your heart what to say beforehand because the Holy Spirit is going to speak for you, okay? For I will give you a mouth and wisdom which all the which all those opposing will I am so sorry. For I will give you a mouth and wisdom which all those opposing you will not be able to resist or refute, and you will be delivered up 
even by parents and brothers and relatives and friends, and they will put some of you to death. Okay? Some of you, some of us to death, right? Not to, not to make you fear, okay? Lord does not give us a spirit of fear, but a power of love and a sound mind. 17, and your will be hated, and you will be hated by all because of my name. Yet a hair of your head shall no, by no means perish. In your endurance, you will possess your souls. But when you see Jerusalem surrounded by armies, then know that, that her desolation has drawn near. Then let those in Judea flee to the mountains and let those in her midst get out and let not those in the country enter into her. Okay, because these are days of vengeance. That the things written may be fulfilled. Holy Spirit says, repeat it. Because these are the days. No, no, the, because these are days of vengeance. That all the things written may be fulfilled. Okay? Woe to those who are pregnant and to those nursing babies in those days. For there will be great distress upon the land and wrath to this people and they will fall by the edge of the sword and will be led captive into all the nations and Jerusalem will be trampled by the Gentiles until the time of the Gentiles are fulfilled and there will be signs in the sun and the moon and stars and upon the earth anguish of nations and perplexity at the roaring of the sea and the billows men fainting from fear an expectation of the things coming upon the in inhabited earth for the powers of heavens for the powers of the heavens will be shaken and then they will see the son of man coming in the cloud with power and great glory okay we're walking into the great tribulation people okay if you're if you're paying attention the stage has been being set okay the world stage has been being set okay if you've been paying attention Okay, it's been been said. So those of you that come across this video and do not know God, that are curious about God, okay, all you have to do and, and, and from the bottom from like from your heart, okay, all you have to do is believe, okay. Say a, a little personal prayer. Uh, uh, pray to God. You know, pray to Jesus. Uh, pray to God. Tell him that you believe, okay, that that Jesus Christ is the only begotten Son of God, and that He came, right, and died for our sins, right, and rose on the third day, okay, and is seated at the right hand of the Father, okay, and. You will be saved. Okay? It's not a cakewalk. Not by far. Okay? That's why God has everything in his hands. Okay? I was going to say something else, but the Holy Spirit said, no, don't say that. God has everything in his hands. Okay? So, pay attention. You got to keep paying attention. Watch the world stage. Okay? We're walking into the tribulation, people. Um, oh, thank Holy Spirit. If you guys looked at uh, the news anywhere, the Israeli news today, they are they are dividing Israel. They're dividing Israel, okay, into two separate parts. I kid you not. I kid you not. And I believe it's Bible prophecy being fulfilled. I believe so. I believe somewhere... I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna find it and come back on here. I believe it. I don't know where it's. I don't want to say the wrong place, but it's in one of the. Uh, it's in one of the books in the Bible, the short ones. Okay, like like Haggai, like uh, like Obadiah, like uh, you know the short ones like that. But it's not you know one of those two. But I love you guys. <laughs> I talk to you guys later. Keep your eyes on God. Okay, do not be scared. Do not be fearful. Okay, God gave us 
not the spirit of fear, but a power of love and a sound mind, okay? 444 on my timer. I love you guys. I love you guys for life, okay? I love you guys for the love of God. I love Christ, okay? Love each other. Peace. Oh, nah. Hold up. They kill the spirit. Romans 8.28. For we know that all things work together for the good of them who love God. And those who are called according to his purpose. Peace.